Today we are going to learn about matrix. First we click on matrix visual. Then we drag the Kate Gary column to rows. Then drag sales column to values. Adding subcategory column to rows also. We will change the style of our matrix from default to minimal and layout from compact to tabular. And switch on the blank rows for better presentation. Now we will go modeling tab and click on new table. I here have a calendar query which will help us in assigning last year. I will paste this query in description of this video. Now I will add visual of slicer. And drag year from my calendar column. Changes its style to tile. I just noticed that 2019 is missing so I will change the end date in my calendar query from 2018 to 2019. Now I will create a new measure. Calculating last year's sales using Calculate Formula. Adding same period last year formula to it. Creating another measure of total sales, the reason for creating this measure is as it will be used in creating difference of current year to last year. Creating another measure of difference whereby subtracting current year sales with last year sales. Another measure for difference percentage using divide formula where numerator is difference amount and denominator is last year sales. Now let's populate our data to matrix.
One thing I noticed here that current year sales is same as last year sales. The reason is I didn't create a relationship between the two tables. So I will drag the order date to the date of my calendar table and click on save. Now my data is being shown. I will add conditional formatting to last year's sales of background color where minimum value shown in light blue and maximum value in dark blue. Add conditional formatting to difference also. Positive value shown as green. Negative value shown as red. Adding conditional formatting to difference in percentage of icons. Where the number if between 0 to 100 shown as green up arrow. And if percentage is negative then shows as downward red arrow. Now we are going to add sparkline which are line graphs in the table or matrix. This shows monthly trend of sales. Since the numbers are not visible in Sparkline, we will create a tooltip. New page is added and renamed as tooltip by month. Go to the page setting and switch on the allow uses tooltip. Create a new visual of bar chart. Drag date column from calendar table to X axis. Remove day, quarter, and year from date hierarchy. Drag total sales to Y axis. Switch on data labels. And switch off values from both X axis and Y axis. Now go to tooltip settings switch it on and in page section drop down it to tooltip by month. Matrix is ready.